Hello everyone, I'm Mr. Mocha and thank you for joining me here. So let's continue playing as a Chuchin Itza. This probably will be, will be one of the last few episodes of this campaign. I don't really plan on conquering everybody. At the end of this campaign, I might show you me owning everybody after I go off screen and, you know, conquer everyone. But really, Volpus's Legion is the uh, biggest enemy, the biggest obstacle that we currently face, and probably the last obstacle that we'll face together. So right now, uh, like I said yesterday, at the end of yesterday, I would go ahead and rearrange my line, and I already actually have already done that. So, I have my spec ops over here on the left. They're going to be kind of a reserve group, just in case one of these lines might fall over here. I think we're pretty good. Yeah, they might have nine divisions over there, four divisions, three divisions, but we'll see what happens. I'm not really too concerned about our war with them. I also upgraded my combat barges, so... Oh well, we really need a lot more water, but at least that's the only resources resource that we really need. I also have some coffee here, having a good time. I'm recording this a little bit later than normal, but, you know, whatever. The show must go on. Look at all these states that we can core. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. So yeah, with that in mind, once I have pretty much all of... Once we're done with this campaign, I already know who I'm going to play as next. It won't be an Old World Blues, because as someone already put it, I've already done Old World Blues quite a bit within the last few months. Oh, we have six days until we can go to war with Vulpus. Well, I don't know if I'll go to war immediately. But, um, yeah, I already know who I'm going to play as. It's a nation that I've been practicing with, because sometimes it can be a little difficult if you don't know what you're doing with that nation. But, nonetheless, it will be a fun time trying, struggling to win. We'll put it like that. Or struggling to fully liberate ourselves. But anyways, the show must go on here. So... Um, yeah, these divisions, they don't have a lot of guys over there, so I'm going to take you guys off already and put two Spec Ops divisions right there. Good. Now, only two. I don't want to send in too many. The supply issue, supply might turn into an issue. Um, you know what? Actually, I have all of you guys around here. All of you guys are over here. You know what? I'll send all of you over here instead. Send all of them in that little corner. Send my Spec Ops. Maybe... Where'd I put him? There you are. Send, um, actually, all of you guys. We don't really need this fallback line too much. Give me you four for now. And then you guys come over here. That might be a better line. Two, three, four. Put you guys right there. They'll never break that line. If they do, I'd be very surprised. But, uh, yeah, I think that's all the waterways that we currently have, which will be good. Hmm, waterways over here, yes, yes, yes. Divisions for Vulpus include up to 273. And they most likely have around, almost probably more than five times the amount of manpower that we have, but that's okay. For we are not mobilizing. Oh. Okay. Well, at least we don't have to offer another sacrifice to Hun Nal Yi, at least at the current moment. I may, however, raise the... Conscription law again for uh, extensive oh, no I want to do minimal exemptions probably I have to be at war estimated enemy strength ratio of eighty percent or more compared to our army that might be okay with against Vulpus maybe maybe no oh one of the following must be true more than forty percent surrender of progress so we are at kind of a conundrum here we only have so much manpower which means I really really need to core out some of these states so um. I should really annex these guys first, take their divisions, then delete their divisions to get a little bit more manpower. Currently, regarding this, I can probably cut down maybe one division here, but that really won't help us too much. Hmm, I'm a little concerned about my manpower now. That's not a good thing to be concerned about. Anyways, anything about planes? A lot of, a lot of planes, a couple of monoplane attackers. I'll send them to Army Group 4, because why not? All right, we have until the 9th of 2026. You know, we should declare war on in the new year. We'll see if they attack us like crazy. They probably will. Over here, I'm a little concerned. Just a little bit concerned, but I guess I do have three of my other divisions over here, so eh, it won't be that bad. So as long as we have enough air superiority, that's really what matters. Um, Put you guys over here, put you guys over here. Ooh, arm alloy smelting. I almost said armor smelting, but no alloy smelting. Anything else? 
Capital ships are pretty good. Everything else is pretty good. Naval rams. Tor oh, they can get torpedoes over there. More rams. Naval trebuchet. Naval ballist. Ba balliste. Balliste. Uh, max speed goes down by 1%. Max speed goes down by 3%. By 2%. By no percent. I like the Scorpio. Ooh. That are light naval craft. All right, whatever. Uh, we're going to go ahead and go with a trebuchet. Trebuchet for life. Also, before we go to war, what does our navy look like? Right now, we got people over here. Four task forces in the, in the Pacific versus two task forces in the Atlantic or the Gulf of Mexico. Looks like right now we can go ahead and make another task force. There you go. Put it in over here. They actually will probably need that. And should I do the waterways? No, let's not. Let's leave the waterways alone for now. We'll see what happens. Ooh, Logistic 3, very good. Uh, do some convoy raiding actually instead. We usually are very successful with convoy raiding. Um, Logistic 3, I think I already took off. Oh, maybe I didn't take off anti tank on these guys. Oh, you guys already have logistics and better specs. Oops, I didn't want to train you guys. You already have anti tank. I could put on fire teams, but it doesn't give you that much more benefit. So I'm going to leave those on. Pretty good. Pretty darn good. Alright. You know what? If I have to core something, uh, what would it be? The cost is insane, though. Yeah, just an insane amount of cost. Yeah, I don't think I can core anything. I only have a thousand political power. <laughs> when you say, I only have a thousand political power, it doesn't seem like... Oh, wait. It's uh, past the year time. When you have only a thousand political power, that doesn't sound like... You got too much, but, you know, old world blues, whatever. Let's have a good time with good old Kaisar. All right, they are immediately attacking us. The front line, not so much. Huh. I do want to bait them into attacking me first, just because I don't want to incur too many losses in the beginning. Because manpower. Ooh, unread naval convoy. Ooh, some convoys. Oh, I love the convoys. Are we losing anywhere? No, we're going to let them have a good time on our own line. Uh, attack this waterway. Attack El Mule. Up, oh, sounds like we're getting navally invaded. Where is that? Spotted an enemy. Oh, they actually have an enemy fleet over here. Uh, is there... Are we spotting them or are we actually fighting them? Ooh, intercom four. All right, very nice. Naval stuff. Um, you know what? Let's go ahead and do some more of this stuff. So, light ship HP. Sure. Sounds like a good idea. All right. Combat barges, please hurry up. Um, so they stopped attacking us. Didn't seem like they were doing very much to us. Hmm. A few more divisions. They still have a lot of manpower. A lot, a lot of manpower. Not bad so far. Uh, we might as well call both our puppets in. Now, do I really want to attack? I really don't. I Oh, they actually navally invaded us down here. Kind of interesting. Where happened to our divisions? They should have held... But, all right, all right. I don't have any spare divisions to deal with that. But, now I do. Put you up here. New army group. Um, 39 political power. Francis Martinez. Hello. Uh, yeah, you have to get up there. Because if you don't, then this is going to turn into a giant mess. Oh, they're going to get supplies. That's really not good. That's extremely not good. Holy crap. What are they using to kill me with? Uh, how thick is that division? We can't really see. Huh. Oh. Naval battle? Did we lose something? No, we sunk two... Four enemy ships. Four enemy shippos. Uh, so, they're not... We found some stuff... We're trying to spot stuff over here, but we haven't found very much. Go ahead and do convoy raiding instead. And you might want to do that area, too. Um, you're just nothing but battle cruisers, which isn't really ideal. Go take Laredo, if you can. Okay, maybe you can't. You guys. Mm. Oh, found some convoys. Very nice. I could advance. I probably could. I could probably do that pretty well. Just, I just don't want to use up too much of my manpower, man. For you guys, I could go ham. Yeah, I don't know why I'm just being so reluctant to attack. I'm. I know we're gonna win. Um, go up with offensive. That's just. That's too good. Go ahead for now. Do a general attack across the entire front. We should. Mostly win. Mostly. Ooh. Seven more convoys. On top of seven more convoys. On top of seven, maybe more, convoys. Thousand, two thousand men have been lost for them. Ooh. Don't lose 
Flight cruisers, do not lose. I need you alive. I need all of you alive. Uh, we're about to probably take Laredo. Very nice. Attack through the front there, which means if we attack through here, we can attack up through this area as well. Maybe. Maybe. You guys are doing okay. Give me you. You can probably take this guy out, honestly. They, yeah, they don't have that much supplies. Good. Let's kill these guys now. Give me one. Come up that way. They're going to run out of supplies, even though I know you're unorganized. You're not really trained that well. And I need to tell this ship, yeah, go ahead and repair, all of you. Hmm. Coffee is some good stuff. Oh, they navally invaded us down there, huh? Hmm. Gotta love water. And they did not take a port, which was good for us. Bad for them, but good for us. Hmm. How many convoys they got? How many succulent convoys? Quite a bit. 31 ships, but obviously their ship count is going pretty far down. Um, I could... Yeah, you might as well go across the river there. Here, you... We might, might as well try that. Okay. Yeah, they've got four divisions. That's quite a few divisions over there. Um... Go ahead and push this way. Get rid of these guys and we'll get rid of these four divisions over here. Yeah. I mean, you can get closer and closer, but you're not going to take anything, man. Um, yeah. I just don't have enough divisions and I can't... I actually... I cannot raise my conscription levels. Yeah, I... More than 40%. I have to be surrendering to raise my conscription levels. That is not a good mechanic for us. Oh my goodness. Oh, that is really, really not good. We can't win, that's okay. We still have a little bit of manpower for now. If I have to do elite divisions in the end, I'm not going to say I'm not going to, but I will consider it. Mm, nice. More ships lost. More ships sunk. Very good, very good. Go and defend that for now, and you come swing around when you're done. Nice, yeah, just make them believe that they can win. Make them believe. All right, so it looks like we could use maybe a few more cells, energy cells capacity. Man, eh, sure, why not? All right, so we are pushing. Oh, 30, 15 divisions there. That's a lot of divisions. But we do do a lot of attack, ground attack. That 57 at that point was pretty decent, not going to lie. Not going to lie. That was pretty darn decent. Uh, losses, we suffered 1,000. .11. They've lost about 10,000. Casualties are looking pretty decent right now. Um, you guys, you can try to attack. I don't expect much from them, so there's that. Other than that, we got to make sure we don't expand too much. There's too many waterways for me to really focus too much on any single one of these. Um, three more divisions right here. Hmm. Three over here, probably, just in case. Mero de uh, Doros. You guys come over here. You will push that way. I'm just really breaking the front line and making them lose a ton of manpower. Compared to us. I should have used it just... Um, do I have hospitals on these guys? I do not. I should have done that. Actually, can I switch it over now? Instead of uh, fire teams. Oh, wait, no, I do have them. I do have cams. Alright, that's good. At least I have cam companies. At least I was smart enough to change that. Oof. Nice. Uh, you guys still have to deal with these guys down here. Pretty normal. Um, Concerning this, I definitely need Laredo covered. If you could, please. Thank you. Thank you very much. You guys are doing fine. Yeah, there you go. Nice. Um, I'll leave you guys kind of in the back just to make sure nothing really happens. It looks like the enemy's navy isn't really available to, at the moment. Not bad. Better, better. Yes, I could use my puppet's manpower, but I'm a little lazy. So, we gotta take out Kaisar, or I guess Vulpus, with about 7,000 manpower. Let's see how we do. Oh, we're doing very well down here, though. Very, very well. Over here, we're not doing super hot. Be maybe a little bit more careful. Felipe, don't, don't just throw away your men. This isn't the the USSR. You cannot just throw away men. Or China. No throwing men away, please. 
Um, how are our subjects doing? Good, Tierra de los Tzotzil will be perishing soon enough. Nice. Gaius Magnus, well, you're going to be kind of dead soon. Oh, God, look at the waterways here. Oh, it's so bad. Oh, but at least the front line's looking very good now. It's very looking very, very good. Yeah, immediately get over there, guys. Immediately so they don't just start walking back over the waterways when we don't have it defended. Uh, for now, just go just go ham. Just go extremely ham. Like, just get over there right now. Because we need... I don't want this to happen too much. Because once we expand far enough, then the waterways won't really be an... Oh, God, an issue. This is kind of an issue right down here. Oh, they are attacking us like a little crazy. Go ahead and stop attacking. Stop. Stop. Well, except for you guys. Maybe you guys should keep going. Yeah. You guys keep going. You guys down here in the south, uh, just kind of hold. Just kind of hold. Don't worry about it. Trebuchet. Cannons. Give me one of you guys. Uh, no, come back this way and do that. A little bit of a mess. A little bit of a mess. Um... Alright, so seriously, at this point, I need you guys to go ex very strongly. Very, very strongly. Please. Uh, you all? Yeah. I need you to go crazy. Like, I need this part of the front, like, done and covered. Yeah, this is not good. Go ahead and hold for now. I... Hmm. The front line system really could be very much more improved. I wish these things were linked up. I just wish that it was a little bit better, but it looks like I'm going to have to take apart this front line because the game doesn't recognize that I need to do something like this. Uh, that's honestly a pretty annoying that I have to manually do this instead of just saying, hey, I want you to take over this sector. Not just a front line, but a sector here. Uh, you guys are where? You guys are already up north. And this is going to make this thing so, so much worse. Cool. And you guys, of course, are taking us down here, which isn't good whatsoever, because I'm running out of divisions. Hmm, yeah, waterways, there's way too many of these waterways. I've complained about this before, but there's just, seriously, way too many waterways around here. Um, yeah, you guys, i got to pull you down. Really, the goal is just, just to kill as many of Vulpus's legions as, holy crap, how are you killing my guys? They're attacking with 14 divisions. No wonder we can't win there. We have air superiority? Better logistics? No, we do not. Well, we have air superiority, but we have no divisions down there. Go ahead and hold. Uh, I need more divisions. So, with that in mind, I need to call on Honduras a little bit more. All right, give me those guys. Thank you very much. You don't need those for guarding things. No, 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 no. Ravi Bink, I'm joined here by my cat, Binky. Too many waterways, and that's one of the reasons why I might not be playing Old World Blues in the next uh, campaign. You get a little bit tired of the waterways, especially in Mexico. Oh my goodness, too many waterways, man. Uh, come down here. It'll take some time for them to come up here. That's fine. Mm, even better logistics companies. They almost don't even use supplies. Oh good, that's small little circumvent. Very nice. Adobe housing, very good. Um, Sure. More energy cell capacity. I like it. This is disgusting. I need you guys to keep moving faster, faster, and faster. Because the front in the west is not... Oh, good. Oh, good God. No, 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 no. You will not get encircled here. Where are these other divisions? No, you gotta come up. You gotta come back down south. No, 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 no. You guys gotta come, like, here. Yep. Playing as a chicken it's a, isn't super difficult, but it's difficult to the point where you don't when you realize you don't have enough manpower I really don't think that this should be still here minimal exemptions you should not be forced to use Carlos Franco or or have more than 40% surrender progress that doesn't make any sense or at least from my perspective maybe it's part of the lore maybe I just don't understand but to me that does not make any sort of sense whatsoever that oh you have to be surrendering in order to raise your conscription level Maybe that's just part of Mayan culture, but I don't agree. And I do know I have something over here, but I'm working on it. I am working on it. You guys keep keep defending as we're wrapping these guys up right now. Um, U12, you're making your way up. You're halfway through there. Nice. Good job, guys. 
All right, take that spot, and it's gone. Good, Outrigger, thank you. Uh, ooh, Spec Ops teams. Hmm, sure, Grappling Harpoons. All right, now, I'm gonna take all these guys off, because there's no point for you to ha each have your own front line, when it would be much better if we could do something like that. Very good. And then, you guys are guarding the front here, which is good. You guys are coming up from the south, and then you guys are in the north, but that's going to be taken care of by our bigger army group. Right, Bink? And then you guys will come down here. See? All according to plan. Some sort of plan. They've lost 29,000, we've lost about 5,000. Just a little bit worried about ugh, manpower. Yeah, we are pretty limited by manpower. I don't like it. How much manpower does Kaisar have? Or Vulpus? He has a lot more divisions now. Wow. Um, that's still a lot of manpower they have. Still a lot. What if I told you, you could make your way over this way, guys? Not bad, not bad. Hmm. This is going to be a problem, which we're going to push hard through. We'll make sure that these guys don't see the light of day. Oh, they're actually beating us. But I doubt our guys have a ton of organization to stop them from doing that. Yeah, holy crap, they're beating us pretty badly in some places. You want to attack, I will make sure I attack you in the butt. Just go on, hold, go on and hold. These guys are going to prepare, and we're going to launch a massive offensive in the northeast. A huge offensive that these guys are going to have to be pushed back, so... Not really worried about it. Not really worried. Honduras. You guys are doing alright. Air superiority. Still doing alright. That's really the way we're going to have to win here. Just pure air superiority. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Um, I want these guys to get a planning bonus, though. That's really what I want. And when we unleash hell, then we will have a great time with everyone. Oh, did I get cut? Oh my goodness, I got cut off. Yeah, don't let them do that. These spec ops, as great as they are, really shouldn't be able to get cut off. Because if they do that, that would not be very good for us. Radar, I forgot to do radar. Well, maybe not. I already have some radar stations up here. That's good. Uh, do some right there, and then do some air bases. We could use always more and more air bases. Cool. Alright, guys, right here. I'm going to need you to push. And I'm going to need you to push hard. Because while these guys are in the north are regrouping themselves, they're pretty much good to go. Alright, now go ahead and, like, terminate with extreme prejudice, my friends. Um, combat barge, probably, just because we need more screens. Very nice. Very nice. 500 factories means nothing if you, have, if you don't have enough manpower. I'll melt them, baby, melt them. Yeah, you will not be able to hold out against all of these attacks. Go ahead and help them out. Uh, no, you can't really attack that way, too. Looks like I'm getting a call. Um, I might need to pick that up, but I'm not going to. Oh, another Spec Ops Division. Hmm. Right here. Oh, there you go. Yeah, no. You can keep attacking me as much as you like. You're not going to win this war, man. Uh, actually, go ahead and take that tile. See what happens. Let's see. Ooh, Troll Warren. Um, manpower. I'm, I'm just looking, man. There's literally no province that we can currently do. We need like 1,500, 1,600 politi political power. That's insane. I think that's a little bit too much of a cost, really, by the time you get here. I mean, we're not starving for manpower, but we're getting close. Like, either you gotta... Make get rid of the 40% surrender progress or make it cheaper to core other states. I think that would probably be better overall. Uh, how's this push doing? I think we're doing okay up here. It's not bad. Let you guys come down this way. Um, go go right ahead. I need some help down here as well. 42,000, very nice. We will be exhausting these guys, hopefully. 30,000 manpower left. They might be mobilizing more soldiers. I don't know. Mm, ooh, let's do that next. Alright, I, I really need the spot, guys. Start taking some of these supply spots. Uh, what the hell, guys? Come on. I know I put some supply base there, but... Uh... Now, this is definitely a struggle. Oh, look at that. They just keep attacking and attacking and attacking. 
Ah, forty-five thousand versus our eight thousand. Oof. You know what? I'm gonna have to stop doing this. I need that political power every day. Two point five five. That's pretty good. That's pretty darn good. Oh, but they are attacking us. Uh, hmm. This is a little challenging. A little bit challenging. Anything over here? No. Special. Ooh, specialized doctrines for our spec ops, maybe. Oh, maybe get more defense. Let's get some more defense. I think that sounds like fun. Don't worry about that. I'll suppress my subjects later. Uh, in the north, don't go super ham now. Just go be balanced. Because down here in the south, more south, we're doing better. Central south. Oh, convoy is very nice. Hmm. Yeah, we can't let them keep expanding here. Uh, spec ops. Okay, what the hell, guys? I told you. Just get down here. Now, I'm glad to leave those guys up north. No, 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 no. Do not do that. I need you guys, at this point, to help me push this way. There's no... There's nothing else. I just need you to help me push. Cover this up. There's too many waterways. Yeah, I mean, look at this. That, that, no, no. Too many. Way too many, man. Go ahead and help, help these... Oh, you already did help these guys out. Push these guys this way. Um, you guys take that area. You come down this way. And come down that way. We are starting for manpower now. This is not good. And um, we've killed over 50,000. They've killed 9,000 of our guys. We are bleeding them a little bit, but... Mm, that's going to be one big old cost to do this. Cut these guys off and we got these guys. Push down that way. Oh, they're still expanding? What the hell, guys? Ugh, disgusting. Mm, I may need to call on more divisions from my puppets. I wonder how... I'm sure Khazar Vulpus has a ton of divisions. Uh, yeah, I need you to just... This is going to cost some serious manpower, but it's a necessary evil to get rid of these guys right now. Yeah, I just keep looking back at this chart. I need more... Ooh, that's not good. What are you guys doing down here? Wait, what are you... What are you guys doing down here? What the heck? I need you all up north. Yeah, come on. I need, like, a huge push this way. I don't want you down here. We already have another army down here, don't we? Um, yeah, you're, you are already down here. Go ahead and do this, because waterways, you know, these waterways really are terrible. They're, they're probably one of the worst things in the Old World Blues update when this game, when this, when this mod got an update. It's just one of the worst things ever implemented. There's too many of them. Really too many. Um, this is good, though. This is nice. Keep them in their positions. Very good. You guys... Yeah, we well, just gotta kill these guys off. How many divisions are trapped? A couple divisions are trapped. Very nice. Grappling harpoons. Very good. Tugboats. Well, let's get some more armor. And we got encircled. We got completely encircled because there's way too many waterways here. Of course. Naturally. Of course. Um, I need spec ops to help me pull this off. Mm, you guys, you gotta retreat. I need these guys. I can't lose 24 divisions. If we lose 24 divisions, we might as well say we're done here. So, do not do this. Everyone come, uh, come down to here. Do that. Push this way. You gotta push. There's way too many waterways here. And you guys in the north are honestly kind of pathetic. I need more pushing. You are pathetic in the north. And I don't want you to be careful. I need you to go crazy. I need you to, like, break everyone you see. And if we can't do that, I'm, I notice we got less than a thousand manpower right now. Then I'm going to have to have a massive retreat to the south. Oh god, we're already getting defeated. That's not good. That's really, really not good. Come on, Spec Ops, move faster than that. Uh, yeah. Yeah, no. Oh, this is not good. This is so not good. This is 
How the hell are they beating me up like this? There's no way. We've killed literally 68,000 of them, and they can still do this. No, 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 no. I need you to push right now. There's no way. There's no excuse for us to lose this battle, this, these wars and stuff. Oh, but at least we have another army here. Contain this threat. Good. Oh, we're starting to lose a little bit. Do not attack, you crazy division. Mm, uh, they're just expanding. I don't have enough manpower. I need more manpower to contain this stupid threat. You know what? We're retreating. I wanted this to be an attack, but at this point, this is a waste of time. This is a literal waste of time. Retreat. Everyone retreat. I, I don't have resources for this. Hmm. Where are you guys at? I need you to come down here. Oh, hold on. I don't mind giving up a little bit of territory if I can save up some time to get a little bit more manpower. Uh, looks like we got a couple divisions here, though, that aren't doing anything. You guys come over here. Yeah. This is a little bit insane. Oh, and they, they've just mobilized for 35% total manpower. That's not good. That's This is BS. This is complete BS. Yeah, Chichen it's a needs a little bit more attention thrown at it than what we currently have right now. Oh, thank you. I could actually use you guys. So, we're going to have to do a massive retreat because I I can't get any manpower. Hmm. I this is not good. This is really insanely not good. Yeah. I would love to do this, but I can't do this right now. I'm going to have to think about this off screen. And, you know, I'm probably going to play this a little bit off screen as well. Just to make sure that we can solidify our control. Because the game devs made it so that we can't have enough manpower. Which, yes, I know I'm complaining about a lot. But this doesn't make any sense how I cannot get any more manpower unless I'm losing. That doesn't make sense. Especially if you're kind of a dictator or a diplomat like me. And just, there's no way unless you have an insane amount of political power. So, anyways... I'm going to play this a little bit off screen and make sure that we can put ourselves in a better position because Kaisar, or Vulpus, is mobilizing millions, literally millions, of more manpower that we cannot compete with. So, anyways, with that in mind, guys, thank you very much for watching. Leave a like if you like the video, subscribe if you're new, and I will see you tomorrow as I try to rectify our situation despite our lack of supplies. Thanks for watching.